Quite simply, it doesn't get any more pressure packed than this. The decisive game at the Euros with everything on the line. Which country will be crowned champions of Europe? It's going to be fascinating finding out. We'll have all the action for you next on EA TV. And this is the game we've all been waiting for. The final itself here at the 2024 UEFA European Championship. I'm Derek Ray, sitting high above the halfway line, and next to me, ready to provide expert analysis, is Stuart Robson. This should be fiercely contested. It's France up against Portugal. Well, there's going to be some nerves out there for sure, but what an occasion this should be. It's going to be tense, it's going to be tight, but it's also going to be dramatic. It should be a terrific game. Well, it could be on for him here. Doing well to win it back. What can they do from here? Oh, excellent diving stop. They favoured a short one here. Vitor Ferreira. Oh, chance perhaps. Able to close down the shot. Well, considering the form book, Stuart, Kylian Mbappe has got to be taken seriously here. Well, he's a good all-round Oh, player. hang on, Stuart, it's a chance. Oh, a challenge that simply had to be won. Ronaldo. On the ball, Rafael Leao. Credit to them for winning back possession. Leao. Well, that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. Now, options are plenty. Getting the better of his opponent. Ronaldo. A oh, great challenge, but not out of the woods. Ronaldo! And keeping it out. Who can he pick out? And the danger's still on. Happy to take on the shot. Vital intervention. Well, it's no surprise. Derek, this could be a goal here. Well, there was impending danger, but good defending. Palinha. That's very effective. Good high pressing. Well, a good tackle. Turam. Oh, that is a wonderful piece of challenging. Bruno Fernandes has it. Vitor Ferreira. Well, that's how to beat your opponent. Can't miss, surely. Oh, yes. First to score in this final. And it could be highly significant. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. So back underway. Will there be a response from France here? To Ham. Well, good run and good ball control. Can he finish this? And a fine stop. Palinha. Well, they have the ball once more. It's an excellent looking attack, courtesy of Griezmann here. And good use of advantage, the referee allowing play to continue. Bruno Fernandes has it. Sloppy in possession from Portugal. Upamecano. 
Can they square the game? It drops for Griezmann. Oh, a goal! He's equalised! Was he made for moments like this? On an occasion like this? Well, here it is again. And what a perfect cross into the box this is. Just inviting someone to attack it. And Griezmann does the rest. He strikes it so cleanly. There's no stopping that one. So back underway following the equaliser. Diesch. Bruno Fernandes has it. It's looking promising. Leal. He's blocked it. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Well, so many possibilities, but it didn't happen for them. That's useful play. Can he put them in front? Oh, it's in! They take the lead here. And just how important could that be in the grand scheme of things? Well, I won't get tired of watching this. It's an outstanding bit of play. Just look how far he runs with the ball. That's a great goal. Well, underway again. It's a narrow 2-1 lead as things stand. Dembele. And players waiting in the centre with both time and space. Credit to them for winning back possession. Pepe. Ferreira. Can they hit on the break? Well, a disappointing end to that break. Oh, big chance. And a goal! I'll tell you what, they're going to be very hard to catch now. Name on the trophy, maybe. Well, let's take another look, and it's a very good goal. And they deserve it, you have to say. They've been excellent. So there it is, 3-1 the current scoreline here. Kunde. Upamakano. Conte. High pressing and good high pressing. Griezmann. Just couldn't get it through. Well, the stoppage time situation, one minute here. Well, the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. Underway again, and certainly dazzling football from Portugal in the first half. Will it be more of the same in the second?
attacking with vigour. And he favours the inside route. It's got to be! Oh, he couldn't outwit the keeper. A gift for any goalkeeper. Well, those stats tell you everything. They're opening up the opposition at will. And while we've seen some really poor defending, their attacking play has been Oh, sorry, excellent. Stuart, look at this. And able to close down the shot. And teammates around him. And he's in. And a goal! Not over just yet. Well, just look at this again. The speed of counter-attack is so impressive. And all you can do is admire the finish by Mbappe. He hits the ball so cleanly. It's a fantastic strike. Underway again, and we're being treated to plenty of goals. 3-2 at the moment. Vitor Ferreira. Here's Ronaldo. Ronaldo. And intercepted it. Oh, that's a super piece of defending. Silva. It's with Joao Cancelo. Disappointing for France to give it away like that. And Portugal moving the ball with purpose. Bruno Fernandes. Bruno Fernandes. Well, in actual fact, it ended up being a simple claim for the keeper. Well, not hard to read that pass. Incisive pass from Mbappe, and the alarm bells are ringing, and the keeper to the rescue. Well, he takes some beating, that's for sure. It really is a top-class save. Played in by Griezmann. Not all that convincing defensively. Well, that's how to shield the ball and control it. And the advantage accrues to the attacking side. That's a foul, and it will be a potentially dangerous free kick. <laughs> An alert reaction to tip it over. Well, let's find out if France can take advantage of this set piece. Whipped in by Griezmann. Struggling to get it away. Mbappe. Just wasn't going to part with the ball. Really getting stuck in. An effective ball. Well, they couldn't quite muster a real threat. Rafael Leao. Well, that's how to put in a clean tackle. Oh, he's through here. Oh, a goal! He's equalised! Was he made for moments like this? On an occasion like this? Well, here it is again, and I have to say, the defending is so poor. They make so many bad decisions there. No wonder the keeper's exposed.
and level again here. This has been quite the roller coaster ride. Balinha. The ball with Pepe. Not made it look routine, but read it well. And it's offside. That was very close. Well, not quite what he wanted to do with the pass. Really good ball there. And Griezmann's in here. Oh, there it is! Incredible! How about this for guts and courage? Can they see this out now? Well, just look at the defending here. They've made it so easy for him in the end. That's just not good enough. Well, a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. Ten minutes left for play. Cristiano Ronaldo. Silva. Portugal pushing forward with options available. Dias. The ball with Pepe. Ruben Dias. Bruno Fernandes has it. Now well, time is of some concern. Can they level matters? This could square the game. But no, thanks to the goalkeeper. Opportunity not taken. Well, you're absolutely right, Derek. The keeper's done really well there. But really, that should have been the equaliser. And there's not long left now. It could be for Mbappe. Well, that is high-level goalkeeping. Well, he's just pulled off a great save there. That's goalkeeping of the highest quality, I would say. Well, they have elected to go to the bench. Oh, the referee points to the sport. Penalty. And this could finish it off. Oh, and it goes! Now he has his hat-trick. A special moment for him. Well, let's take another look. He chooses the right way to dive, but it's a good penalty because it's the height that beats him as it goes above him. Not a scoreline we see all that often. 5-3. Bernardo Silva. And Palinha with it. Well, the electronic board lets the fans know. Three minutes of stoppage time. Good weight on that pass. Oh, breezing past him. Aimed towards Mbappe. Oh, wasteful. Very wasteful. Well, I think that's an easy chance for him there. The goalkeeper can't believe his luck, can he? And there goes the final whistle. France have won the Euros on this pulsating night here in Berlin. The joy, the ecstasy, also the disappointment but ultimately the feeling of togetherness. Well, I have to say, they've been brilliant throughout the tournament. They were great today as well. They are the deserved champions, no doubt about that. And these are very special scenes that we're witnessing. And now with the pressure off, a chance to reflect. 
a chance to celebrate. The trophy about to be presented. The European champions, France! What a great moment for these players. Absolutely brilliant. And it doesn't get any better than this, does it? A chance now to celebrate with their own fans. And the fans have also played their part. Just listen to the noise here. Great end to this tournament.